of you guys know, I used to be really into flying drones uh, but I never really get a chance to find the big one, the expensive one, only the toy one, the mini, uh, the mini drones and uh, I have to, a lot of expensive hobbies like 3D print, printing and making other stuff so I have to make a choice because I don't have a lot of budgets um, so I dropped uh, uh, drones for a while, I didn't do anything with it but when Gearbest contacted me and said they're going to offer me the Spar, I was super excited. I can't wait to get back to it. It's a really expensive one, like my shirt say, build, crash, repeat, mostly for me just crash. So I got to practice more because I'm not an expert, but I think I can do it. I can handle this. Let's open it and take a look. They did a very really good job uh, on packaging tons of bubble wrap. Yeah. Here it is the, the DJI uh, Spark. Okay, let's... They have a bag for, I think, for carrying the drone but they also have a, a something like a suitcase maybe you can carry it like this I would prefer if they have a handle All this, I think, is the instruction in different languages. Yeah, it is. <laughs> cool. So no matter, no matter where you come from, they got uh, all the language, so don't, uh, you don't have to worry about uh, the instruction. I choose the version with the remote control if you connect with your phone the range is much much less and I don't want to lose it uh, the power adapter cable and this must be the propeller guard In the front, uh, this is the USB cable and the battery charging hub. More this here. Okay. And um, this is it, the DJI Spark. Oh, finally. And it's pretty lightweight. I think I, I don't have trouble uh, flying it and the f it, this is the front camera and this is the lithium battery um, I have to go find it now I, I don't uh, later I'm going to tell you other stuff bye I may be a bit over eager to uh, try it out with the smart uh, it turns out actually it's raining now, so I'll just have to do the setup here. Uh, I promised my friend at the Gearbest I will finish the review this week, so let's get started. Let's hope um, it will work because the DJI uh, might require the GPS signal and I'm indoor, so it probably won't work, but we'll try it and let's see. First, you have to download their app, it's called the DJI Go 4. You can uh, download it at the Play Store or you can uh, scan the QR code at the battery component parts here or the storage box. <coughs> <coughs> I 
and then go to the uh, left corner uh, on the top choose spark and then select the free light icon on the right and try to scan the QR code I heard that in my <laughs> some people it doesn't work for some people so oh it doesn't work for me also um, QR code is not clear scan fail I should probably just connect it to the Wi-Fi first so and make sure your battery is fully charged because if, if it's not it won't work and also don't use the uh, mini charger uh, don't use the charger just for the mini one it doesn't work also I try so you have to use the one that comes with the um, uh, comes with the DJI uh, spark set Press it twice, it will work. Okay, and now I'll go to the settings. Okay, now I'm connected to the uh, Spark and uh, it pops up, uh, the DJI UAS products terms of use pops up, so just click by activating your aircraft, you agree to the DJI UAS products terms, I agree. Activate Spark. Activate your aircraft. Uh, I can fly indoors and I think I need to practice more. But now everything is set up. I'm pretty happy about it. Going to the flying lawn. Uh, so now I'm going up. Uh, there's tons of stairs. I hope. <laughs> I hope I can make it because I'm not that athletic. Let's go. Starts to ring again. So this is the drone view. I'm just uh, waiting for the ring to stop. It's going on and off. I guess it will stop soon. I hope so.
Okay, that was my first day trying to fly the uh, spar outside. I know it wasn't impressive, but I'm also not a professional pilot. I'm just a hobbyist. I used to fly the little tiny drones, uh, but I found the spar is uh, much easier to fly. So I really appreciate that. I have a nice time. It was relaxing. I didn't um, have to worry. I will crush it, anything like that. After today, I started to build it more like a flying camera than a remote control toy. Uh, you know, I go out and I always use my selfie stick to film my 360 videos and those are very popular. But it, it's like a long thing, 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 thing like this. It's like a long selfie pole without the stick. And um, it got, uh, and it has a wider view, it has a border view. It can show the whole picture of the family, the hotel, the beach, or whenever you are, you can get, you can also get the 360 view of it because you can fly around. I will put the buying link in the description box. At last, remember, if I can do it, anyone can do it. Thanks a lot for watching.